friends, welcome or welcome back to my channel. I'm so excited to be bringing you today's video because I have a huge Hobby Lobby haul for you. So if that's something you're interested in, then just keep watching. Now, I always have to make this disclaimer just so that way everybody knows, the old and the new people, that I am going to do my best not to edit this video. My hauls are more of like my laid back, relaxed, unedited videos because generally I do those in my downtime and I normally don't have much downtime. So let's not waste any time. Let's hop right in. Now, when I first walked into Hobby Lobby, my Hobby Lobby is ginormous, you guys. I can never get through it in one day. It's just way too much. But I always make my way over to where the seasonal stuff is. And on this particular day, all of their spring labeled stuff was 50% off. So the first thing that I picked up was this huge wood round. It is part of their spring collection. So anything with this spring shop tag on it was 50% off. So originally this was $22.99. It is 22 inches and it's huge as you can see and I got it for $11.50. The next big item I got and it's another wood item is just like that round sign but this one I don't even know if I can fit it all in frame. It's this huge unfinished wood sign 24 by 48 the original price was $39.99 and I got it whoa I got it for 20 bucks um, my idea with this was if you've been around for a while then you might remember when I was pregnant with Miss Isabella two years ago I redid my bedroom in my old house and um, this is what I wanted to do with this was make a big sign for above my bed here at the new house. So if you guys wanna see a updated, brand new bedroom makeover video, let me know down in the comments because this is what we're gonna use to go over the bed. Okay, so I'm gonna stick with the wood items since we already did those. So the next item I picked up was also from the spring line. It is this wooden truck and it has all the little seasonal changed, I don't know what you want to call it. You get to change out the back of the truck for each season. So you have pumpkins, a flag and stars, um, flowers, a dog and a surfboard and a beach ball and then some trees. So I thought that would be super cute um, to either do on that big wood round or maybe something else. Um, if you want to see what I would do with this, let me know down in the comments. And then on the same subject, basically. Now these were not in the spring collection. These were back in the wood section. Um, with the wood pile stuff at Hobby Lobby. This, for $12.99, you get six 14 inch wood rounds. And then all the wood pile stuff was 40% off. So I don't know exactly what that would be, but I thought that that was a really good deal for um, six 14 inch wood rounds. And they're thin, but they're not as thin as the ones from Dollar Tree. So I picked up one pack of the big ones, one pack of the medium size, and one pack of the small ones. So the small ones you get six for $3.49, and they're, they are six and a half inch rounds. Really, really good deal for six of these. And then these are $7.99 for the 10 inch wood rounds, but only three come in here because these are double the thickness 
of the larger and the smaller circles. And these were $7.99 at 40% off, so about five bucks. Moving on, I picked up one pack of half inch candlesticks. You can do so many different things with these. You can make little risers. Um, you can use them for legs. So, so many ideas. Or you can paint them and put candles in there. Totally up to you. So I picked up one pack of those. These were $5.49. Again, all that stuff was 40% off. And then these were $4.99. These are also candlestick hold holders. And this is $7.00. Eighth, seven eighth inch. Good lord. So one pack of those. These were uh, $4.99. And then that's it. That's really it for the wood stuff. Um, I got this stainable wood filler. I didn't have any and I really needed some, so I just picked it up while I saw it. But that's kind of like a boring item. Um, and then I also picked up two of these risers one is white one is gray this one was part of the spring collection and it was only $3.99 at 50% off so two bucks for that yeah that was definitely a steal and then this one was $7.99 this was with like all the table decor um, but I still felt that because all the table decor was also 50, 50 or 40% off. I couldn't remember. So I still felt that four or five bucks was still a good deal for um, a heavy duty, nice quality riser like this. So let me know in the comments. Do you guys think this is a good deal or do you think I should have just gotten another one of these? Either way. Um, along the lines of the tabletop decor, this was the next item I picked up. It is a glass cloche. It was $9.99. It, it, the table decor was 50% um, off now that I'm thinking about it because I remember looking at this and being like, oh, that's five bucks. That's a pretty good deal. But I see a lot of people put these on tiered trays and like put little stuff in it. So... I picked that up with that in mind. Only picked up one of these. And then I also picked up two gel stains. One is oak, one is walnut. You can never have enough gel stain. Come on camera. And then I also picked up three different paint markers. I've never tried this Hobby Lobby brand before. So I picked up one pack of the white, one pack of the black in the medium tip, and then I also picked up one black in the fine tip. And these were all, this one was $2.99 and these were $4.99 a piece. Okay, this is for my daughter. This is from the spring collection, so I got this 50% off. $2.50, they're just cute little sun catchers. She loves stuff like this. And I love watching her do stuff like that. So I picked up one of those. If she likes it, I'll run back and get another one. Um, but... This is the kind of stuff I keep around when I need to do something and my kids are wanting my full attention and I have to be like, look, you got to sit down and chill for a couple minutes. Let me get this done and then I'll be right with you. So this is the kind of stuff I keep around for those kinds of times, you know. Y'all, it is hot here today. It is 84 degrees. And if I leave my shed air conditioner on, you guys will not be able to hear what I'm saying at all. So, sorry, I had to get a sip, I was parched. Okay, the next item I picked up 
antique bronze plated clasp with locks. Two sets. Come on camera. So I picked up one of those. And then I also picked up all of the other clasps that they had. Button clasp, bronze plated clasps, and antique brass plated clasps. And then these are the swing arm clasps. So there's these two. And then this one is the swing arm and the brass plated. camera and then I also just picked up four antique brass plated curved hinges okay and then this is it you guys I didn't pick up a whole lot oh there is three more yes three more items so um, this one was in the spring collection. It is just a ceramic jug. And I have one that's really similar. So I got this from Hobby Lobby. Oh, no, I didn't. I got this from Walmart. But that's what that jug reminded me of. So I, I picked up this one so that they could kind of be like a set. I don't know. I don't know, I'll have to just decorate with it and see. But I thought that was super, super cute for five bucks. Really good deal, good quality, good size. So if I like it, I want it. I want it, I want it. I like it, I want it. I gotta have it. <laughs> anyway, so I also picked up a hot knife replacement. I couldn't find these anywhere. And then, last but not least, I picked up a little sewing kit. My daughter always asked me to sew stuff for her, and I grew up with my mom and grandmother sewing stuff for me, so I always like to have a sewing kit on hand, but with the move, I don't know what happened to it, I don't know where it's at, so I figured I would just pick up another one for now. Um, and this one's really cool. It has a bunch of ribbon in it. Um, just all kinds of stuff. Pins, needles, scissors, um, a pin pillow, buttons. I mean, so, so much stuff in there. For $7.99, I thought this was a really good deal and good kit to have in, you know, laying around in the house. So I think that's it, you guys. Let me know your favorite item down in the comments below. Also, don't forget to let me know if you guys wanna see me do that truck. And if you'd also like to see an updated bedroom makeover video, I would love to bring that to you guys. So don't forget to do all the youtube -y things. Hit that thumbs up if you enjoy this video. Share it with your family and friends if you think that they would enjoy it as well because those thumbs up and those shares really help my channel to grow. My big goal is to get to 100K by this, by the time this little babe is born. Can't see it from where I am, but that is October and 100K subscribers is my big goal. And I would love for you guys to help me get there because as I always say, none of this is possible without you guys. So know how much I love and appreciate you. And as always, if nobody has told you today, you are absolutely amazing. You are stunning and worthy. You are so strong and you can do anything you put your mind to. And with all that being said, I love you guys so much and I'll catch you in the next one. Bye. Check out the videos that are popping up here to your left while you're waiting on my next upload or join the DIY fam here to your right.